what's happening youtube how are you guys doing today welcome another vlog of daring whips so what we're doing today is we, we are changing the oil change on my bmw so if you if you don't got a bmw you're probably not gonna like my video so might as well just like wait for another videos because you guys like, sure gonna like the other videos that i'm gonna be making this is a guy that was this yeah with some tires yo hello kyo with tires nice skirt you need some toyos right here baby 270 out the door, cash price. Bring me cash, you leave with these. Regular price is $350. I'm giving it to you for 270. That's the homie discount right here. Hell yeah, baby. Toyo, yeah. look at this sticker, man. Toyo. Original. You can't get better than that. 65,000 miles. On All right, so that's that's his BMW. You know the f***ed up BMW yeah, he has. So that's the shop. If you guys, if you guys want like cheap tires, better tires, just make sure you have, hit him up. He lives in Vegas, so I'll put, it the, put the link description, link in the description for his Instagram. First, you jack up the car. Uh -huh. If you're doing it at home, uh -huh. then you put a catch pan, or uh -huh. catch pan, uh -huh. under uh, where the bolt is, where you loosen it. Uh -huh. Then you take out the bolt, let it... Uh, the drain plug. The drain plug, basically. You, uh -huh. you take it out, let the, all the oil drip out, uh -huh. and then you can start, go ahead and uh, uh, take out your filter put the new filter in and once the oil is all completely drained you put the drain plug back in and then after that you start to pull a put a new oil in there that's it that's it simple all right easy so this is this is where the filter goes right yes that's all the right. filter for bmw so all right the cars you see it on the side it'll be sticking out you're just gonna be like a cartridge filter all right all right so you explained to you guys already so first thing you gotta jack up the car obviously and basically the first thing you need is a mechanic to do it because i've I'm just a driver. I got no idea what I'm doing. So the mechanic is, so mechanic is doing everything. Actually, I'm not doing anything. I'm just recording and driving this car. You know. So first thing you want to do is screw, screw. That's right there. Open it up so we'll leak it up right there. That's the oil coming out. So once it's done, then you just like. Come on, bro. It's too hot. Then you open up the. We gotta get a strap. He's gonna grab a strap. What is this called? Like, filter. Uh, yeah, this is the uh, this is the housing basically. This is where the filter is on the inside of this cap. This you're never gonna want to use oil filter pliers like this. A lot of people do. You wind up scuffing and scoring the outside of this. You're always gonna want to use a rubber band wrench. That's the best way to Get do it. Get that, you guys. That way uh, you don't hurt anything. You don't hurt my baby. <laughs> This is an order from the shop. Look, he ain't even doing shit. He's just like standing there looking like an old fucking lady. All right, that's how a filter looks like. Or, well, actually, that's not how it's supposed to look like. I'll show you in a minute how it looks supposed to look like. It just pops on to the bottom. See how dirty my filter is? <laughs> yeah. Shit is black and as fuck. This is what it should look like. Uh, it also has the house. That's how it's supposed to look like. Yeah. And that's how it was. And, and I'll, show you, I'll show you how to replace everything. Yeah. I'm gonna be a pro now, bro. That's I'm gonna take good. a small little pick tool or a very fine screwdriver and get underneath the gasket and just work your way around to work it all the way out. Once it pops, then you just put another grab one. Grab the new one. And then this one, you don't just shove it on. You want to install it the same way that you uninstalled the other one. The reason for that is, is that this lays one way. If you get a twist in one side, you're gonna have two spots where it doesn't seal on either side. So you want it to be, stay straight all the way down. If you're gonna do that, you're gonna take a small tool. And you can work it on there nice and slow. Come on now. There we go. Come all the way around. And once you get it seated in that groove, you wanna make one final pass all the way around just to make sure it's sitting as even as possible. Then you're good. Then you're good. And you just put this filter in, stick Where's, it in. Oh, it's got a new drain plug. Nice. And the filter goes in like that. Real Sits right into place. And then set this directly back in here. Spin it back in, tighten it down with band wrench. Good to go. Here. Started it. Then you just tied it up like that. I was a lot more of a stoner. And I usually take the zero, uh, zero 05, uh, 5W30, but I'm putting the 0W30 because, like, uh, there's more stuff to come into my car. Just wait, you guys. Just wait. Just wait. 
Yeah. That's right. a new, uh, new drain plug because the old one has the old O-ring around it just like that oil filter did. The new one's got a new O-ring, so we're going to go ahead and use the new one. All right. Castro. All right, so this is where we got the oil. Yes, sir. Okay, so you put all five bottles in there. You gotta go to BMW to ask how much does your car take, cause my takes 5.2. Last but not least, hopefully my engine's still working. <laughs> right, Mr. Owner? Yes, sir. Like, yes, sir. Problems, you know, like there'll be a fire in there somewhere, but you know, it's normal. <laughs> And you don't take care of your car properly, like he doesn't. Close the cap. And that's how you change the oil on the BMW 328i. Okay, to reset it, you want to hold this button for 10 seconds. Yeah. And it says reset, so hold it again, I guess. All right, reset in progress. There it goes. So you're supposed to keep the ignition off. Engine off. Ignition keep the engine on. off, ignition on, and then you just press this button for 10, 10 seconds. 10 or so seconds. And um, then the just thing pops up. Just hold it until up. the screen pops up something right here. Uh -huh. And then and you, you just click it. it from there. And then if you want to, there's like more information in that menu. Mm -hmm. That menu cannot be accessed unless uh, your the car is uh, mm -hmm. like in, the, in, in ignition mode. Yeah, on. you got it. All right. So if you're not sure how much oil goes in your car, just call the dealership. Or if you do know, you're not sure what the level is and it does not have a dip stake cars like these BMWs, the F30 series, um, they do have this uh, internal system. You just go to options, you go to menu, and then you go to vehicle status, and then uh, vehicle information, and just go down, scroll to the oil, and then you just click a uh, check oil level. You just click on that and it's gonna measure or measure oil engine oil level and it'll measure it for you the car has to be warm it mm -hmm. has to be still in park or mm -hmm. neutral standing still it can't be driven it has to be in a flat slope not tilted or anything and then it'll tell you if it's max all or right what. like it says engine oil is, that was okay so we're good all right you guys so that's how you change the oil on a bmw 328i uh and there'll be more videos that are coming out about this bmw and they're gonna be pretty pretty dope because this video was all about the oil changing and the BMW, but the next videos are going to be like, just watch. I don't want to tell you guys, I don't want to ruin the fun, because just watch. Just wait and watch, because you will like it. You'll like it, because Thanksgiving is coming up, so I'll give you some good bangers for next week. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe for more fun.